Welcome to the Just Montina channel, where we're having conversations about marriage, men, and mindset. If you're a new viewer, subscribe. And if you're already subscribed, thank you. So today, I want to have a conversation. And the question that I want to ask you is, do fit women attract better men? What do you think? So I was in the gym and I really thought about this when I just have these epiphanies in the morning. I wake up and this was on my mind. I went to my Pilates class and then I go to the gym. I do a quick hit workout, some abs, and then my yoga. And I thought, do fit women actually attract better men? Have I attracted better men in my life because I tend to be what others would consider fit um, I've never been overweight I've been a little larger than I would like <laughs> but never what anyone would deem as overweight and it just got me to thinking about that and I know that we all revert back to Kevin Samuel saying men want fem feminine beautiful inspiring cooperative kind submissive women but what I want to talk about though is can we accept this as a fact is it a fact that because I'm a fit woman, I attracted a better type of man? Now, here's the thing about physical activity and being fit. Most people that are fit tend to, to well, I'd say 98% of us have to exercise and eat well and healthy. While there is that 2% that y'all going to just be skinny no matter what, okay? Skinny itches. <laughs> There's books about you. But... Physical activity does trigger the release of dopamine, serotonin, and that, of course, can improve the mood, right? But eating food, having sex, um, watching your favorite movie, reading your favorite book, taking a long, hot shower, soaking in a beautiful bubble bath, those can also trigger the release of dopamine and serotonin, which can improve mood. So it's not just saying... It's not enough to say, oh, if you exercise, you're going to feel good. Yeah, it's going to reduce anxiety. Yeah, it's going to reduce some panic attacks. But other things do as well. So here's the thing. I'll tell you, as a woman that's been fit most of her life, I have not always attracted amazing men. Maybe I have. You know, what? I'll, I'll restate that. I probably have and didn't know it. And then I made some bad decisions early on in my late teen years, early 20s, where I believe it inhibited me from attracting the best spouse that I qualified for in my 20s. So we'll be talking about that more on this channel. I, I really want to help 100 women. Actually, I'm going to say it like this. I am on a mission to help 100 women get married. That's my mission, y'all. I want to help you get married. But we need to have real conversations. So back to the fit. Um, I don't believe that fit women attract better men. I believe that feminine, kind, cooperative, submissive, fun women attract better men. I'll give you an example of someone that I think is amazing on YouTube that you all should follow. And that's Megan Moon. I, I've seen her over the years. Yeah, I maybe watched all the five videos. And recently, I'm on the other side of YouTube as I'm starting a new channel. And I'm just seeing all these like new YouTubers. I'm like, oh, I haven't seen her in years. And I love the relationship that she has with her husband. If you are a young woman, I told my daughter this. I said, you need to watch Megan Moon. She is so fun. She is a fun wife. I'm like, oh, my God, she'd be a fun friend she'd be a great daughter and her husband just genuinely seems to just have a lot of fun with her and being the fun woman the fun wife making you know we want men to make us laugh but just being just being easygoing and peaceful in your relationship it adds so much value and so much joy happiness and peace to your home so she's an example but back on topic no I don't believe that fit women attract better men I believe that you should be fit, um, your version of fit, but I'll tell you over 40, over 45, that weight sticks on you. I have to count calories, I have to exercise, I have to intermittent fast. It's not easy. And I don't think that men 
over 40, over 50, and even over 60 expect you to be your 20 year old version of yourself, especially if you didn't have some babies, okay? <laughs> so that was just a thought that I have, and, and that's what I'm gonna do on the Just Montina channel. I just wanna talk. I, I want you to think about things. And if that's not the case, if fit women don't always attract better men, then what can you do, number one, to be the best version of yourself? And that does mean being the healthiest, best version of yourself and fitting good in your clothes and feeling sexy and confident. What does that look like for you? Because I want to help you attract the best man you qualify for at your age. Okay, you qualify for something and men like women of all sizes, long hair, short hair, all different races, color creed, everything, it doesn't matter. But sometimes in life we have to choose who likes us because my grandma says, who you like is not going to always like you. Okay, so I love my husband. My husband loves me. But I tell you this, you know, when he found me and he demonstrated that he liked me, I was like, okay, I like him too. I did like him, but I, it was pretty easy because I'm like, oh, his man really adores me. I adore him too. And he's so easy to love. Having someone that pursued me and that I attracted and he chose me and I chose him. He's so easy to love. I want you to have someone that's so, so, so easy to love. So that's it. Let me know if fit women attract better men in your opinion. Leave me a comment below. And if anything, leave me an emoji with that, that uh, what's that muscular sign with the muscle sign? <laughs> All right, I'll talk to you and see you in the next video.